This is how to build a shulker box loader and unloader. Let's begin. But first, please consider subscribing, leaving a comment on what I should build next, liking, and sharing with your friends and family. Let's begin. Now first, we're going to go off with the uh, loader. The chest, the hopper, the block of redstone, the redstone comparator, redstone dust, and I made a little smaller version to the fact I just just remembered something. But of course, a building block of your choice, redstone repeaters, a redstone dispenser, a piston, a slabs, let's just transfer that, slabs, and is there anything I'm missing? Of course, glass and glass. Let's begin. Place down two chests, one hopper here, place a slab on top, by shift clicking, place a temporary block, place another temporary block with one space between it, get your piston out, and place it. Remove the temporary blocks for now. Place one stone, redstone comparator, a redstone block next to it. Leave it in the current mode it is in. Place a lid, a uh, small staircase next in front of the redstone comparator. Place a block of glass on the redstone that is right in front of the redstone comparator. Place redstone dust on top of the glass. Run redstone dust to the top of the to the top of the piston. Red redstone dust down. Place in a temporary block for the shulker. Place in the dispenser. After a few more temporary blocks. After you do that, run a line behind it with one torch. I forgot to mention the torch. Let it power the redstone dispenser. Run a repeater into it. No tick. And now, place in a shulker box. Once the shulker box is placed, place in your hoppers. And one chest. On the dispenser, place in a hopper next to it place in a chest. Fill that chest with shulker boxes. And fill the chest with whatever you're densely packing. Once done, this will place several items into these. All the items that can fill into it. But it has to be bulk storage, so the same item in every slot. But once done, you have built a shulker box loader. Now, off to the shulker box unloader. It's a little more complex, as you can see. Now let's just clear out our inventory. Now, you're going to need a note block, observers, pistons, chests, hoppers, redstone comparators, redstone torches, redstone repeaters, and last but not least, a redstone dispenser. 
And of course, a block of your choice. Oh yeah, and definitely not least, dust. Now, let's begin building. First, place a couple chests next to each other like this. It doesn't have to be double chests, but I just prefer doing that for just larger storage. Grab a piston. And place it here. This block does not need to exist. I also place a dispenser. The dispenser, after being placed, attach a hopper here and a chest there. Or, you don't even need the chest, you can just run into a storage system or something. Place a block, block here, a block there. We're also going to need our note block and our observer. Place a torch here, a repeater here, a repeater, and a redstone dust on the blocks to shut off this torch. Three ticks on the repeater. Now the system here is nearly done, but now we need a block here with a comparator. The comparator has to detect when this is completely empty, which shuts off this torch and tells it to get it to the next one. Now to the second part of the system the one that tells it when a new block has just entered it. Now place a block next to the dispenser with block one lower just to its right if you're facing from the chest side next to it. Once you've done that, place a comparator on top and an observer detecting it. Once done, place a block behind the observer. Once you've done that, it is done. Now, just let's say you have a bunch of items in a shulker box. Throw it in. That was odd. Oh, that's what I messed up. Okay. Now it should be good. You need to place dust on top of the note block. But once you've done that, you have completed the Shulker Box Unloader. We'll separate it between the two chests. But now, consider leaving, leaving a like, subscribing, commenting for the next thing I should build, and until next time, I'm Unbeknown Tech. Peace.